in Cape Town. I am so happy for the warmer weather because I thrive off just summer and spring all together. I thought, let me get a head start on Christmas. I know Christmas is still far away, but every year what I feel when it comes to Christmas time, I don't finish the things that I'm supposed to clean. So I thought, this should be like a good opportunity for me to clean some of the areas. When it comes around Christmas time, I know that like the curtains are washed, the pantry is more or less clean, a few areas in our house I don't have to worry about, and but also I'm using this opportunity to also spruce up my place just a little bit, you know, add some spring-like colors and make it more not so drab, I guess. So I have bought a few things that I can just spruce up my place with. It's not a lot. I'm not someone that fully decorates for different seasons. Only Christmas and even that is a lot. But I thought I'll do a little haul for you guys of some of the things that I've purchased. And then we're going to do a little bit of spring cleaning. I've already done the bedroom. Like I've cleaned the baseboards. I've vacuumed behind the bed. And then obviously do some decluttering as well. Because you know with most spring cleans or just cleaning in general. You do a little decluttering. So let me show you all the things that I purchased. You are literally sitting on a makeshift tripod. Because my tripod broke. But it's fine. So I'm going to do the homeware stuff first. First and foremost. I bought these coasters and they are a Terezio coasters that I bought at Mr. Price home and I wanted to replace the ones we have because the ones we have is cork and the minute something melts on there or gets wet it leaves the stain in the pattern I thought let me elevate my house just a little bit with these coasters one of the simplest ways that I kind of just bring my house a little bit of life is by changing the pillow covers on my couch and so i got this like mastery one and also a linen lilac one i've never gone for purple or pink i always kind of stay with like the greens or the yellow i do have other cushion covers i'm gonna pay this with so i got these at h and home next up i always replace my shower curtain because it always just gets moldy at the bottom and i buy an inexpensive one i don't buy an expensive one i thought why not change it up and go for this kind of floral print can you see i always buy it at people again inexpensive because i throw them away anyway another way that i also just brighten up my space and make my kitchen just look a little bit put together is details these details are so cute look at this again people of all places and i thought i could use this one now for spring and this green one for christmas time the last thing i got was just a photo frame and i wanted to have a picture in the bathroom for the longest time i'm not gonna put it up in this video just because i'm not gonna deal with nails and stuff i'll wait till kuna gets home so i just got a normal 15 by 20 picture frame and was the price home and then i saw on someone's youtube video where they spoke about just replacing the pictures you have in your home and so i went and got pictures replaced or I pictures printed for this frame and then also the frame that we have hanging in the living room this is what the oven looks like with this cleaner on I left it on too long because I was watching formula one but I'm just gonna wipe this down and hoping that the oven will be clean because it's been a while since I've last cleaned <laughs> the oven So while the oven is busy drying and eating out, I am going to do the under the sink cabinet because Courtney didn't do the bottom parts of it and so not looking too great. Like, can you see, uh, there's been some cleaning. I'm going to wipe out the bins as well. It also just needs a little bit more organization and yeah. This is officially clean. All the bins have been cleaned out, neatly packed. All my back stock is at the back. Off to do the next cupboards. Okay, all the drawers are done. And I have obviously minimized it. I've got a lot of expired stuff, things that I don't use. This drawer, medicine cabinet is done. And where all our Tupperware goes is done. So I'm just gonna do this last cupboard, which is where my pots are and some of my baking stuff. And actually to rearrange some stuff there at the back.
This bookshelf is not great. Number one, I want to clean it. But I also want to rearrange a few of this stuff. And actually take those things off and see if I can put it on that shelf. If I'm being honest, this just looks dreadful. Let me clean this and rearrange it as well. Okay, I quite like this. I might change it as I go along. I can't get rid of those core stuff because that's Courtney's. I decided to put some of my non-fiction books here just to give it some color because I'm finding that it's just so neutral with green. Next thing I want to do is just work on this. This has honestly been a catch-all for everything. And I want to rearrange this because I think I can utilize this space a lot better. Oh my gosh, look how bad this is. This is behind our media console. I kind of wanted to deal with this first before I start with that. That plant is officially dead. When I get to a nursery, I will put another plant there or buy another plant, but do not come for me. That plant has been resilient. I think this wasn't where it flourished the most. I cleaned my wine. This is wine that I want to give away. This is usually where the flower typically stands, so the leaves fall at the bottom. Okay, let me quickly just clear that. This is done. So happy. I rearranged a lot of stuff. I made sure all the back stock is over here. My onions, my, what do you call it, toaster. The onions over there. We don't have a lot of space in our apartment. So when Courtney built this, this was just extra storage. Our air fryer goes there. And then the oil and some Tupperware that is not mine. That I have to give back to people is at the back. Just need to deal with the stock part. I'm so tired, I'm not going to lie. I feel like I'm all over the place. But this photo frame was hanging on top over there. And I actually have some pictures that i had printed i'm actually just going to replace all of these pictures in here and this is just another way to kind of not really spend money but just to sh like make your space just a tiny bit different i also need to clean this frame though because it's been a minute since i've done it <laughs> oh it looks a lot nicer and it's recent pictures, so I think that's what makes it that more fun. And these ones, can you see yeah, what the... It's like not great after a while. But anyway, let me hang this up. This is what my shower curtain looked like before. Also, I'm currently cleaning the bathroom. So I've done the toilet, I've done the basin. I'm going to take these stuff out so I can mop the floor. Give the bath a good scrub-a-dub-dub. -dub, especially that shower head. I don't know when last I did that shower head. And this is the new curtain. It is so pretty. I love how it just brings a pop of color into the space. But at least the bathroom is clean. I mopped, changed the mat, changed that little basket over there. Honestly, changed the towel and done so this is the picture that i had printed and i want this to kind of go over here i know it's orange and it's might be clashing with the colors but not really i think it will look really pretty over here i'm actually seriously tired i forget how much spring cleaning or just cleaning in general just take everything out of you i still have a few more things to do uh, as you can see i need to clean this desk I need to clean the top of that part, vacuum in certain areas, especially this room. And I need to change out putting my summer stuff into the second bedroom or the main bedroom, sorry. Then I just have to pick up here and there. Still a lot of stuff kind of laying around. I still have to do this area. Need to clean the kitchen. Honestly, amazing, but also disgusting. How quick an area can get so dusty. And you don't even think that it's a dusty place because I'm always cleaning.
I'm officially done with all the cleaning. There isn't anything that I still need to do besides Courtney having to hang that picture in the bathroom. I'll go through the freezer some other time because Courtney did clean the fridge for me. But I hope that when it comes to Christmas time that I just have like a few things, you know, that I have to do and... I'm gonna try and see if I can make an orange cake quickly. <laughs> I think my mother-in-law is coming. I'm not sure. But yeah, and I now obviously transitioned to all my summer stuff being inside this cupboard. And I folded all of the things and looked at the things that I am not wearing. So they are packed in this bag. I'm gonna donate these clothes that is in here because no point hanging on to things that I'm not even gonna wear. Someone else can make use of it. But the only thing I still have to still sort out is the shoes because my boots are in here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you're gonna be spring cleaning. Maybe you're just gonna avoid it and wait for Christmas. But gosh, I'm glad there's a few things that are ticked off my list. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!